As the Russia-Ukraine conflict rages into the third month with no sign of truce anytime soon, the entire European continent is bearing the brunt of the crisis. Many say the conflict and subsequent sanctions on Russia are causing widespread panic over regional security, soaring food and energy prices and a looming drop in the standard of living. L'autre problème que pose la guerre en Ukraine est le risque d'inflation dans toute l'Europe et notamment en Europe centrale. L'inflation était déjà repartie à la hausse suite à la pandémie de la Covid-19. Elle risque de s'accentuer et de peser lourdement sur le pouvoir d'achat des ménages européens. Each European member state faces a different set of challenges, and that's part of the complexity of dealing with an EU of 27 member states. The role of gas in Europe is also going to be highly debated, contested, and trying to find alternative sources to replace Russian pipeline gas is going to be very challenging. Είναι πάρα πολύ δύσκολα τα πράγματα. Είναι δύσκολα για τον κλάδο, για τους πρατηριούχους και δύσκολα και για τους καταναλωτές. Το κάψιμο είναι είδος πολυτελείας πλέον, ενώ ξεχνάμε ότι είναι κοινωνικό αγαθό. Neko u toj strategiji, tokom realizacije te strategije ekspanzije na istok. Prvo što treba reći da su sankcije nelegitimne i nehumane. Sankcije, dakle, nisu sredstvo za rešavanje nikakvog sukoba, nisu sredstvo mira, nego su sredstvo eskalacije. Treba videti da su sankcije...